Hi all, it's Emily Rand with ESPN Esports, and I am joined by Pharaoh of the Florida Mutineers. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, to be here. How would you rate your performance with the team since stepping on? Because I know you did not have all that much practice uh, prior to this weekend. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, I only scrimmed one time with the guys online. Um, but, I mean, first match, in my opinion, I played horribly. Um, I let my team down. I told them that. And I told them I'm going to come out with the fire, you know, these next couple series. And hopefully we just, you know, keep the hype that we have right now. Well, and if I'm not mistaken, you're doing a bit of a role change, right, going into this roster. Yeah. So uh, what has that been like for you? Um, it's a little weird because <laughs> I'm running a full-time sub, basically. Yeah. And uh, I'm playing for Pristini, which is a super fast player, uh, super aggressive. I mean, I play fast, but not that fast. <laughs> um, but, you know, the guys are meshing well, and, they're you know, they're supporting me. And they know it's going to be an adjustment, but we're making it work. Yeah, what was it like coming onto this roster that was established and also, um, you know, Pristini was kind of a vocal leader on the team. So uh, what has it like been stepping in with the guys? I know you said they, they've actually been great and given you a lot of help. What's the team dynamic been like? Um, it's really good, to be honest. They uh, they basically told me, you know, whatever makes me feel comfortable. So like in S&D, like I'm calling a lot of the strats. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, we're brainstorming on how we want to play the game, like us, rather than, you know, how their old team played the game. So it's basically just like me joining a new team and just uh, learning everything with the guys. What's the main difference uh, between this team and, like, playing on Parasite's team? Um, <laughs> I would say a way more stacked roster skill-wise um, and definitely a way more bigger support system. Uh, you know, we have Ricky coaching, and he's been helping, helping us out a lot. What was it like getting the initial call? Like, were you expecting it at all, or um, is it because no. from an outsider it happened like that? Like, it yeah. happened over a matter of like 24 hours. Yeah, it, it happened really fast. Uh, I was so grateful. I'm so grateful for the uh, mutineers to you know reach out to me and you know give me this opportunity. Um, I feel like I'm really good at this game, and I'm happy that they gave me uh, a chance to basically show you know how good I am. Going forward, how much do you think you'll be able to improve? Like, do you think you'll be able to make that finals match again? Uh. Yeah, I think we could definitely go to the finals. It, I think it just comes down to me playing up to my standards. I feel like if I play really well, you know, the guys all play really well. And when I'm playing well, I, I scream and I get hyped and, you know, I get my team into it. Uh, and these guys all feed off that, you know. So, uh, yeah, if I just keep doing that and keep up my, you know, my pacing and everything, we'll be good. I, I see us in the finals. All right. Awesome. Thank you so much, man. All the best going forward with Florida. And for more Call of Duty League coverage, keep it here on ESPN Esports.